one of the most exciting aspects of the research hub is, is this sort of interdisciplinarity, which is really pushed, I think, to the extreme, much more so than what you can find in many, many other uh, interdisciplinary research buildings around the UK or, or around the world. There's a lot of STEM focus, so we have quantum nanotechnology, technology touching life, uh, chemistry, but we also have uh, other fields of, uh, of research that branch more into social sciences and creative arts. And that's going to be a challenge, a very interesting challenge, but a very exciting one, which I think will definitely bear its fruits. This is the attraction of the hub, is to interact with people that you may not have thought of interacting with before. So we're with chemists that think about chemistry in totally different ways to the way we've done before. We've got physicists that are thinking about light and about imaging in ways that we've not thought of before. Cell engineers, which are looking at the way that cells interact with matrices and the like. So we've got a terrific uh, opportunity to do things that we just simply haven't thought off before. I think it's exciting and something new and I, um, I like to ask interesting questions in new ways. Typically I get that by just going to new conferences and talking to different types of people so I think the different cultures and just the random occurrences that might happen in the hub are exciting. One of the things that holds us back in our work is um, the structures that we have been trained in and now function in in academic research and the structures are disciplinary and I think that what we really might need to do differently is to rethink our own expertise in relation to others, to think about what we don't know as well as what we know very well and I think working in collaboration with other disciplines and having very difficult conversations to try and find common ground is a possible pathway to doing things different, to approaching problems differently. Some of the themes in the hub are by nature very, very international and very global, so I'm hoping for a kind of broadening out almost geographically of our research, I mean, you know, engagement with really generally global kind of questions. But I'm also expecting that there are things I just am not predicting at all. And I think that kind of, you know, that sort of, you know, serendipity is also part of the attraction. I hope that um, people will enjoy being in the hub. and enjoy the challenges of talking to people who are not doing the same things as them. Well, I've been in my job as director of my research institute for almost 10 years and I've completely given up trying to prescribe what people should do in their research. And the most important thing you can do is have them enjoy their research and if they enjoy their research they in invariably end up doing something worthwhile and interesting and they'll bring other people into that circle.